Hi, I'm Casey Musman, the owner of Nocturnal Design Studios in Los Angeles, California. Nocturnal Designs is a special makeup effects studio. Uh, we work with film and television and do a lot of really cool makeups for camera. Ashley is a cosplayer that we've worked with before at our booth Nocturnal Designs at Monster Palooza and she loves to embody creatures and she really comes to life when she takes on a scary creature. So when Ashley called me and said she wanted to be a clicker, I thought that was amazing. It was a perfect combination. When I was on season 12 of Face Off, we had a Last of Us episode where the challenge was to create infected from different mushrooms. I've always loved The Last of Us. I've been a big Last of Us fan. And it was really cool because Neil Druckmann, the man who created The Last of Us, was our guest judge on it. So we each got to pick our own mushroom and go through the creative process of how the characteristics of this mushroom influences our clickers. And it was really fun process to get to do this with Neil Druckmann because it was just like being on the game. So that was pretty amazing. So every time I sculpt something, even if it's something that's based on an existing design, I always like to make it my own. I always like to do my research. And this was an opportunity to really deep dive into the fantastic world of fungi and really get to experience uh, all these new textures. So one of the parts of my process that I really enjoy is looking at source materials. I also think as an artist, it's really important to connect to nature, connect to elements around yourself and find different references that you can see and feel and bring them into your own. Anything can create and inspire a new shape or a new profile. Everything will have a different kind of texture, a different kind of shape. And so when you bring these things into your workspace, even if you are working on something otherworldly like an alien or a zombie, then you can use these very real shapes and anatomies from nature to incorporate and create a design that no one's ever seen before. And that's very magical and very imaginative. The mushroom world is super colorful and full of so many interesting and intricate patterns and textures. And I just can't wait to paint this piece and bring a lot of different colors. Uh, one of my favorite colors in the clicker makeup are the oranges but I feel like I wanna also vamp that up and use the traditional colors and maybe pull some more from different species of the cordyceps, as well as bringing in some of the inner human anatomy um, and all the vein tones, all the blood vessel tones, rigor mortis tones. So it's gonna be a real cool mesh of different colors and patterns. One of the great things when you are recreating something that has already been told, a story that's been told before, you bring yourself to that and you can bring a new version, a new tale, a new story to the table. So as a designer and as a makeup artist, I always try to find the most creative possible way to do that and make it interesting so that you will see something that is new, something that's exciting and will be able to connect with a lot of audience. I think as a working artist and a studio owner, it's very important to give back to our younger artists and I've been an instructor at Cinema Makeup School for um, the past few years. And that's something that is very important to me to be able to have this connection with the upcoming generations of future artists and putting together teams so we can all learn from each other's creativity.